Well guys, uh, Dave here for the Black Hat Brothers, and I know I'm sorry for not making a video in the past two weeks, and also not wearing a black hat in the video. I mean, I blew it on two levels, folks, and I'm sorry about that. But I'm back today, and I'm probably going to be back next week. Not sure about that, though. Uh, busy schedule next weekend, so there might be a video halfway through the week, maybe on Wednesday or Thursday. Who knows? Um, but I'll be still posting puns on the Facebook page, so, you know... If you don't have videos, you have puns, so whatever. But, um, you know, I've been listening to a lot of Matchbox 20 yesterday, or today, or lately, and, uh, you know, I've talked about this on previous videos, where I go through these phases of listening to just one artist, and um, never a variation, except if it's, like, a genre or anything like that. And uh, I go through these phases of just listening to one artist. And uh, this time, uh, this month, or this, you know, week, or these past weeks, um, it has been Matchbox 20. Uh, and more specifically Rob Thomas and uh, you know he is a great artist and uh, I, I used to listen to his stuff a lot it's just another artist where um, I've listened it's, it's just another artist where I used to listen to the artist and, and then I come back and re-listen to it and I was like wow this is really good no wonder I listened to it back then and I'm back to it now so it, it's like it's just another one of those artists and Rob Thomas is an exceptional artist he is a great musician um, I know he plays a very good variety of instruments, and he is amazing at uh, singing. <laughs> His voice is amazing, and it's like it's that it's that kind of punk rock feel. Um, it, it's really good. He has a really good voice, and uh, you know, it's, it's I've been listening to a lot of Matchbox Twenty, and uh, it's been good. It's been good, and uh, you know, I mentioned I mentioned uh, you know listening to these artists like these really good artists that I have not listened to in years and it's coming back again so just another artist and uh it, it's been good it's been good uh, I've been listening to him for the past couple of weeks um I recently got a lot of his albums on my iTunes uh bo both Matchbox 20 Tabitha's Secret and uh Rob Thomas's solo stuff but lately his stuff has been you know dropping uh I don't want to say it's terrible, but it's not as good as his older stuff. So if I, I if if um if you are planning to listen to Rob Thomas or Matchbox Twenty, uh, Matchbox Twenty, uh, it doesn't really matter. But Rob Thomas, uh, more importantly, um, if you're planning on listening to him, listen to his older stuff. Uh, I recommend his older stuff. Uh, you know, pre two thousand eight probably would be your best bet. Uh, I can't really list any songs, but just you know. Pre-2008 is your best bet. Any Matchbox 20 stuff is pretty good. Even the newer stuff, it's still pretty decent. Though also, I would go with the older stuff when it comes to the Matchbox 20. And as for Tab Tabitha's Secret, um, it's really interesting. He, it, it, it's his, um, it was his band uh, while he was creating Matchbox 20. So there's some like older demos of like you know songs like 3AM and songs like that where he uh, made the older songs of Matchbox 20. Um, there are some like very very early demos of those songs on the Tabitha Secrets ad album so Tabitha Tabitha's Secret I keep on saying it a lot uh was his band before Matchbox 20 back in the late 90s 96 97 uh maybe 99 there's also some live shows with uh his band from there uh in early 2000s so I I, I really like his music um Rob Thomas, Matchbox 20, and Tabitha's Secret all like so they're all really good songs. Uh, just go pre dated 2008 on the Rob Thomas stuff. And also, you know, the older Matchbox 20 stuff is pretty good too. P Tabitha's Secret. Some of the songs eh, are better than others, but some they're pretty good. I really I really like them. So I've been listening to them a lot lately, and uh, hopefully you can too. So thank you guys for watching uh, this episode of Dave's Faves on the Black Hat Brothers channel. I'll see you guys later. Also, if you guys could also please like um, and comment down below. And uh, if you have not yet, please subscribe to the Black Hat Brothers. It would really help. It's really awesome. And also, I will be wearing a Black Hat Brother, Black and Black. Hat, I'll be wearing a Black Hat in the next episode. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.